Yo, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the car. Before we get this video going, go ahead and hit the like button. Sub subscribe if you already haven't. And for today, um, before the car goes off to Jason's shop, I'm gonna go ahead and pull the turbo and the manifold off. Um, as you can see how it looks, I'm not really a big fan of how it looks. So I'm gonna go ahead, I actually bought high temp primer and paint so we're gonna hit this on this today so let's get the intro going and let's get back to the to the video all right all right so um i'm actually gonna go ahead take the headers off and the turbo I might take the turbo off first and then take the headers off. I gotta do either one. I gotta do one of them first, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna take one of them off. I might just take the turbo off and see if, it, if it'll if it stay like right here and then take the headers off and then go from there. That's I think that's my best bet. All right, bet. All right, y'all boys. So after that time lapse, as you can see, I got the turbo off. The turbo is actually fitting up on its own with this, dude. This is pretty impressive that the turbo is fitting up. Um, I do need to take the wastegate off. I'm thinking about if I need to take it off or not. I just take it off. It won't hurt. Um, once I take that off, put it back on, and then just kind of clean up back here. I'm gonna just hit it with some brake cleaner, get it clean wipe it down and then clean the headers off and then start priming it that's the plan so let me just brake clean back here i'm not going to use i'm not recording me brake cleaning the exhaust port around the export <laughs> the exhaust port before you guys think i'm spraying inside there i'm gonna spray around it kind of clean up the surface area a little bit make it a little bit look a little bit cleaner and then go from there and i'm gonna pull the wastegate off so don't be surprised when you see the wastegates off all right so right now i have 400 grit sandpaper and I'm just gonna rub it on it just to take off all the excess rust and all of that from around it. I'm gonna just try to get everything that I can. So it has a clean surface to stick on. And I'm gonna time lapse it starting now so you don't sit here waiting for me to finish it. All right, so that's as clean as I was able to get it. I don't even want to touch it really to see because I don't want to, I don't want to get it dirty. <laughs> and I kind of brake clean it and everything. Oh, I kind of had it brake cleaned and everything. So I'm gonna hit it with a light coat real quick. A very light coat and then go from there. All 
All right, so I had moved the um, the manifold from outside and kind of rigged it up to fit here. <laughs> this is with one coat of the silver that I got. I didn't get black, so I'm just spraying it silver. And this is one coat. Um, I might go get a, a heat gun to kind of speed up the process. Or I might just let it hang here for a little bit and then come back in like 10, 15 minutes and hit it again. So... I'll be right back. All right, y'all boys here is the end result. That's how it looks. It's dried, it's not perfect, but it looks decent. So I'm gonna go ahead and throw this back on the car for now. I know you're supposed to bake it, blah, blah, blah. I don't, I don't have anything to bake it with. So I'm gonna go ahead and throw this back on the car, get it bolted up and wait for tomorrow to go to Jason's. But with that being said, that's it for today's video. If you liked the video, give me a thumbs up and subscribe for more. I'll see you guys in the next one. I'm out. Peace.